ever felt overwhelmed from routine tasks that you have to repeat over and over? All what you need to do to overcome such a dilemma is to watch this video to the end. Hey guys and welcome back to our channel. Today I'm going to show you an amazing all-in-one solution that is going to save your time and effort. It is called Magical and it's used to create automations that will do your work for you spontaneously. I have been using Magical for almost a year now where I have managed to save more than 7 hours weekly of routine repetitive work. I'm gonna give you a brief tutorial on simple automations that you can make with Magical, which will make your work routine easier. Before exploring Magical's feature, you need to set it up first. Head to Chrome extensions, Now search for Magical. Now install this extension. Once you are done, you will find Magical's extension in your Chrome. So now pin, pin, it, pin it so it will be easier for you to access Magical anytime you want to accomplish one of your repetitive work. Now the first amazing feature of Magical is the ability to scrap huge amount of data from different sources without having to write any complicated code lines. It is even compatible with almost every site. Unlike Zapier which integrates with 7000 apps, Magical integrates with more than 30,000 apps. So let's see how we can do this integration. First you need to choose the site name that is going to be your source to scrap data from. I'm going to choose LinkedIn since it's one of the top websites in the business niche. Now you can search for any job title you want to scrape data about. However, I'm just going to head to my network. Then I'm going to open more than one profile. Let's say I'm going to open up to 20 different profiles in new tabs. Now we have 20 different results. Next step is to click on magical extension. Then clicking on this first panel, you will find that Magical have linked the existing data in the current open tab with well-known data titles like name, address, email, and more. If this data lacks vital information, you can link it by manually clicking on add more on the bottom, which is activated here. Then you will just click on any of these information that is not existing. So of course here we don't find that the university name. So I'm just going to click on the school name. Well, school name exists already here. So I'm going to another thing like the location, for example, I'm going to click on it. Then I'm going to label this information as, let's say, location here. Then I'm going to click on save. Now you can see that our information has been added successfully where location here is linked to this port. And when you are done, you can just click on done on the bottom. Now, after linking, we will do the next step, which is transferring this data to a spreadsheet. So we can head to add to a new spreadsheet here, click on it, then choose all tabs if you want to transfer all these data in all these tabs to spreadsheet, or if you just want this one, this tab, you can just choose this tab. So here I will choose all tabs.
it's somehow heavy because we just opened large number of tabs together. So after a few seconds, you can see that your data has been successfully retrieved and saved. No effort, no time wasted, and no complications. Now let me just close some of these tabs. So if you are not interested in all this information, but yet interested in just one or two fields, Magical will also enable you to do so. So let's suppose you want to extract the emails of a LinkedIn user. You will again open uh, that user's profile in a new tab, then click on Magical Extension. And instead of exporting or transferring all the data, you can just copy and save the email of the user. So by clicking on this tab, you will find that email is plored, so you can just click on find and you will find that the email is loaded successfully. So you can just copy this mail and save it anywhere you want. In addition, you won't have to waste time anymore on completing forms and building your infrastructure on CRM panels as Magical will just do this for you. So let's say uh, that you want to transfer this data into forms instead of spreadsheets. So let's just visit one of the CRM panels like Fresh Sales. You will need to keep the tab that contains the needed information open during this process. So now by visiting Fresh Sales and clicking on Add Contact, you can now write double double slash and then a drop down menu will appear in front of you. So this drop down menu will contain some results that you can choose from. And you will also notice that the first result is the one which is identical to the field you are filling. So by choosing this one, you can find that the other data like first name was filled automatically. You can also do the same to the last name and job title, for example. So easy as you can see. So this was the first basic feature of Magical that will save your time and energy. Now moving on to the next feature, you will be able to format a message template that can be used anytime you want and on any site. First, create a new tab, then click on Magical extension to, to open a Magical tab. Now create the template you want by clicking on Create. Then I'm going to write the form I want. So I'm going to write Hi, Greetings, for example, Greetings. Then I'm going to place a placeholder here. And for those who don't know what a space, uh, what a placeholder is, a placeholder is simply a feature that changes based on the data retrieved from Magical on any open tab. So let's suppose I'm currently on this tab. So the the, the placeholder will be changed based on the data retrieved from this exact tab. So you will just digest it more when I repeat this exercise in front of you after completing the template. Now I will place the placeholder as first name, then I will write, I hope you are doing well in, then I'm going to place another placeholder, which is company name. Now there is one missing step before completing your uh, template, which is adjusting a trigger. And a trigger is simply a way through which you can call out this template and make it happen. So to write a trigger, you can just write any word you want. So I will write welcome. But this is going to be a problem because if you just wrote welcome anytime by, by accident, you will find that Magical will represent this welcome, not just a word, but as a trigger. And it will automatically load your template. So you want to add a simple so that Magical will not get distracted. So I will just place add at the beginning of my trigger and click on save. Now I'm going to head to the open LinkedIn tab and I'm going to choose message. 
oh, I need first to click on done here. Then I'm going to click on message. Now there are two ways to recall your template. The first one is to just write the trigger that we did before here, or you can just write double slashes and you will find a drop down menu appear in front of you. So this is helpful when you have so many triggers and you just don't remember which one will lead you to your template. So here is my trigger, welcome. Now you can see that the placeholders here appear again. Now you need to click on each placeholder to replace it with the information represented by this specific placeholder for this specific page. So by clicking on first name, it's obvious that the first name of the, this person is called Ahmed and it's loaded successfully. And the impressive part is that Magical do this automatically without your intervention. So you can see that the message has been delivered successfully and it's all set and ready to be set. You can do exactly the same steps if you want to compose an email template and send it to different individuals. So by visiting um, any email platform like Gmail, for example, then click on compose. Now write the same trigger as we did before. See, it is successfully recalled again. So there is also an amazing feature that you can use with Magical, which is automatic AI responses. Let's suppose you have many emails or offers presented to you daily and you want to reply on these offers without having to compose a message every time. Let's just close this and this one. So here you can see that we have three automatic replies, which are yes, no, or customized. So if you clicked on yes, for example, you will find the magical will create an, an AI created message automatically, which it accepts the offer, but in the form of a message. You can also do the same by clicking on no, while if you chose to customize, now you will have to give uh, magical some information so that it will get this information and inc incorporate them into a well-written mail. So this is pretty much it for this tutorial. I hope it was simple, brief, and informative. So if you like this uh, video and you want to check out uh, Magical yourself and save incredible sum of time and effort, you will find a link down below which will redirect you to install Magical for free. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more useful hacks and tips. Thank you guys so much for watching and hope to see you in next tutorials. Until then, take care and goodbye.